Hey Guru Nation, just did a long podcast and this topic came up of uh, why research sites need me to negotiate their budgets and please if you are a new site and you don't negotiate your budgets or if you're a brand new site and you haven't gotten a budget yet, when you do, please get somebody who's experienced, who has some experience, just even a little bit of experience negotiating budgets and contracts to do it for you or at least teach you how to do it or go watch one of my YouTube videos on how to negotiate contracts and budgets we've done like at least three I can think of and we're gonna have future webinars uh, this year on how to negotiate contract and budget the reason is and I went in in depth on this on my podcast episode 69 random musings of the clinical trials guru shameless plug go check it out Uh, it's on iTunes or on Google Play uh let's say there's a study a big study let's say it's a 90 site study okay that's a really big one usually they're like 30 to 60 sites but let's say it's a 90 site study 30 of those sites are going to be expert sites these are sites that the sponsors and cro's love because they constantly recruit solid number of patients they're consistent their data is clean very few protocol deviations if any these sites can name their price on their budget and they're gonna get it the CROs who oftentimes negotiate these budgets will sometimes even lose money off of these sites the other 30 remember there's 90 sites total the other 30 will never negotiate a budget and the CROs but they might enroll a good amount of patients also this is where the CROs make their profit from the loss on the other 30 sites and because they don't negotiate and so the CRO gets to keep that as profit. Now the middle 30 they do negotiate and usually the CRO makes a little bit if not break even on those sites. So be one of the 30 at least be one where you're not getting totally gypped by the CRO. and I learned this from several people high up at the CRO level uh, when it comes to negotiating contracts of budgets and also pay attention to when you do negotiate when they send you back the budget uh, lately a trend has been that they will actually send it to you lower for some reason and some numbers get moved around and somehow the total budget number is lower than what the original budget was even though you're negotiating higher amount so pay attention for those kind of things Um, but just negotiate hire someone who's an expert or bring on someone who's an expert go watch one of my videos or hire us as a consultant we're going to get you studies as well as negotiate your budget for our flat fee talk to you soon guru nation